This is one of the most beautiful parts of France, La Lozère, at the north of the Languedoc-Roussillon region. The landscape is immensely varied and high on the plateaus is the home of the super breed of Aubrac beef that is famous for the quality of its meats and for providing the milk used in the making of tasty cheeses. Every Saturday morning in the Cathedral Square of Mont, there is a charming farmer's market. This farmer's farm is in the mountain and we see him to the market, he brings some live rabbits, some potatoes that are very popular in the region. A selection of jam made with his fruits, some mushrooms that he has dried from the mountain, some herbs and some of his own eggs, so it is fabulous. Near the cathedral is an attractive shop run by Françoise Bonal, a third generation butcher and small goods maker. Francois's pork sausage with cabbage is a local prize winner. I am very impressed with the high quality of her meat. The lamb looks so sweet and tender, and the beef from the Aubrac Charolais breed, outstanding. Donc, euh, je vous présente la pièce de bœuf par excellence du boucher, c'est la côte de bœuf. C'est une viande super tendre, avec des fibres courtes et euh, très maigre. Donc, on aperçoit peu de gras et avec une couleur euh, rouge écarlate qui ressort, euh, qui re ressort une viande très tendre. This hearty beef casserole with olives is ideal for winter dinner party. First, I place four slices of roasted blade beef in a bowl with one sliced onion, one sliced carrot, two crushed pieces of garlic, a few sprigs of thyme, two cloves, one tablespoon of perno, and half a cup of a big red wine. I cover with plastic film and marinate overnight. After this time, I then place two tablespoons of flour in an oven-proof pot. Stir in the marinade, the vegetables, and the beef, before adding half a cup of strong stock. Covering with foil, the lid, and cooking in the oven at 120 degrees. To obtain tenderness, I cook the beef for three hours. I then add three sliced anchovies, 20 black olives, and two globes of fennel cut into segments. Cover again and cook for 30 minutes or until tender. It is traditional to serve it sprinkled with parsley. This paleron de boeuf aux olives is an ideal match with a Shiraz. Back at the market, I enjoy witnessing local chef Hugo de Oliveira making aligo, the famous regional dish. Aligo is made with mashed potato combined with a local young cheese cut into pieces. Hugo invites me to prepare the big batch for the locals. And I can't wait to taste it. Mm. Now this is delicious. It is delicate, it's not too strong, it's just perfect. Merci Hugo. Tomorrow we are in the Ardèche where we discover the great chestnut specialties of the region.